L'hydrogène est un élément polyvalent et riche en énergie. Il pourrait être la solution pour assainir certains des secteurs les plus polluants de la planète, s'il peut être produit de manière propre et bon marché. Mais c'est là toute la difficulté. The main thing that we need uh, in order to produce in hydrogen is green electricity and water. A good move for Europe is first like to decarbonize, but like direct electrification is not always feasible or cost efficient, so that's where you will need renewable hydrogen. Hello and welcome to Business Planet. This is where it all starts. Electricity is produced here at this solar power park in Puerto Llano in southern Spain. That electricity is then sent to Iberdrola's nearby plant to produce green hydrogen, which in turn is used to make zero emissions fertilizer. L'hydrogène propre est un élément crucial pour la décarbonisation de l'industrie lourde en Europe. L'Union européenne a pour objectif de produire 10 millions de tonnes d'hydrogène renouvelable d'ici à 2030 et d'en importer 10 millions supplémentaires dans le cadre des objectifs net zéro. Cependant, la production d'hydrogène renouvelable en Europe n'était que de 20 000 tonnes en 2022 et l'augmentation de la production présente de nombreux défis. We need to improve a little bit more the technology in order to be implemented in a massive way. We need a clear regulation and clear permitting process and we need access to the grid. What happens to the hydrogen that gets produced here? We supply this hydrogen to our off-taker, that is Fertilera, that is a fertilizer company. They use this hydrogen to produce ammonia and after that with this ammonia they produce a lot of fertilizers. Today with the hydrogen that we can supply, the carbonized 10% of the ammonia production. This is the building where the green hydrogen is actually made. Let's take a look inside. A l'aide d'un électrolyseur, l'hydrogène vert est produit avec de l'électricité renouvelable pour séparer l'eau H2O en hydrogène et en oxygène. La Commission européenne a mis en place un cadre réglementaire pour l'hydrogène propre et investi massivement à hauteur de 22 milliards d'euros. The big question is that behind all of this is also the question of the money and the funds. You have the innovation fund, you have the big one, which is the hydrogen banks that closed the first auction a few weeks ago. It was 800 million euros, the first auction. So we estimated that it's around 600 megawatt of projects for renewable hydrogen that are going to be funded. But to get to the targets and the levels we need, uh, that the EU has uh, set forward as well, we need way more funding into this. Les secteurs polluants comprennent les transports, les engrais et l'industrie lourde. À lui seul, l'acier produit environ 7% des émissions de CO2 dans le monde. Le consortium suédois Hybrid produit de l'acier en utilisant de l'hydrogène vert pour éliminer l'oxygène du minerai de fer, remplaçant ainsi les fours traditionnels alimentés au charbon. Nous nous sommes entretenus avec Suzanne Eriksson Rostmark de la société minière suédoise Elcab, l'un des membres d'Hybrid. If we have fossil free energy available, a hydrogen can be produced uh, with only water and fossil free electricity, so it can be produced without carbon dioxide emissions. And that's what we want to get rid of in the steel making process. Mais il reste encore beaucoup d'obstacles à surmonter. One of the things that we are struggling with is the permitting processes. Uh, they are quite slow, so we, we are ready to start building now, but we are waiting for the permits. À l'heure actuelle, l'hydrogène vert est plus cher que l'hydrogène dit gris ou brun, qui est produit à partir de combustibles fossiles. Mais l'industrie espère que l'écart se réduira avec la baisse du prix des énergies renouvelables. In the near to medium time future, we see that the prices will be approximately 20% higher than for brown steel. If you translate that into a car, then it's about uh, less than 200 euros extra per car. At the moment, clean hydrogen suffers from a chicken and egg supply and demand issue. The EU is hoping its focus on a clean hydrogen ecosystem will crack the problem of decarbonizing heavy industry like this. See you next time on Business Planet.